Hello YouTube, welcome back to our Let's Play of Don't Starve with Willow. My name is Ben and you're watching Sparky Hobbies on YouTube. I do have a Twitch channel that I occasionally use called Sparky Gravity. It's my main handle and I have also like a vlog if you want to check that out. But anyway, let's get in here. We were uh, looking around for our fire pit in the dark because I accidentally caught my all of my trees on on fire here. That's okay, Willow likes fire. Okay, let's, uh, I have some wood, right? Yeah. Excellent. And let's get the crock pot. And let's not add any more fuel to fire if we can avoid it. My health is doing really well. I've got some food. So I kind of need another drying rack. Uh, let's, let's see what that takes, right? Takes three rope. Right, okay. So let's get our three rope going. One, two, three. And that way we can create another drying rack. Can I build it right there? I can, excellent. And let's go get that jerky and put it on the drying rack. Excellent. And hopefully that other jerky will be really ready soon, and I can just get that last bit. Now, unlike in the crock pot where sometimes you'll use it and um, eh, it's almost daytime, let's not even bother lighting that up. Um, when you use jerky, it'll heal it all the way. So, wouldn't mind to get some farms going. And let's pick up this axe and use up this axe. It only has like 11 left, yeah. And we got a full grown birch, which is excellent, which is what exactly what we want like during the fall. And looks like we got an extra frog. And we got plenty of charcoal. So, create another drying rack, which with the frogs might be the way to go. It's probably the most energy efficient way to do our food with the frogs right now. Um, but these birch nuts, autumn is the time for birch nuts. That's just the way it goes. Um, The thing I could do is start looking for spiders. That wouldn't be bad. And let's plant all these birch nuts. It's fairly, st still fairly new in the autumn cycle, so that will probably work fine. Let's check a trap. Set trap. And let's get another grass or two. Create three more ropes. Make another drying rack. Get that last beef. So this space is becoming fairly well established. I think it might be a good idea to take this cut stone and go ahead and commit to a lightning rod. Lightning rod. Get that last beef that I have. Where is it? Chester, do you have it? Where'd Chester go? Here, come here, Chester. Yeah, let's take that. And dry that last beef there. Alright, cool. Got frog legs. I've got already another sandwich going on. Uh, one of our birch teas just grew up, so we're going to chop it down immediately before it does anything crazy and revert or anything like that. Oh, going to have another axe, all right, so. so it looks like we got food and we got logs and we got all of the basics fairly well established here. 
like I said, wouldn't mind getting some farms going on. Let's put the charcoal away and put these 20 logs away. Plus these three logs, we don't need them right now. And let's plant these birch nuts. Get that growing. Uh, do need some boards. That's right. That's kind of what I was doing. I was just getting some logs for some boards. I might have to create another trap. We built close to the froggies. That is okay. Uh, so yeah, I need a lot of grass in this area. Um thinking about just transplanting all of this grass. Uh, it's not really doing me much there. Where else might I go steal a whole bunch of grass? There's some berry bushes up there. That's actually a decent place for a... There might be more up there. I'm thinking I'm going to leave that place alone. That might be a nice place for a base. I think I'm going to collect all of this stuff and move it closer. So... I guess I go do that now. Hopefully it's regrown. It is not regrown, so do I leave it until such a time as I want to Choices, choices. Some of our trees have grown up. It's good. I do need quite a bit more grass, though. I mean, especially if I'm going to get inundated with frogs. If that is going to be my life. The other thing I could do is just create a wall and block it a little bit. I like being close to my food sources, so I don't think it's that big of a deal. Oh, my guy accidentally clicked off my screen. Um, yeah, we can probably go get this last last tree right here. And well, I get that berry bush. It's pretty close to the road. I don't know. With that, we should be able to make some boards and uh, see what else we could prototype. I think I just need for this alchemy machine, which is like the science station 2, I will just need the boards. I'm pretty sure that's all I require left. Both of those have frogs, okay. Another drying rack would not be a miss. Um, okay, so I got the logs. Let's create some boards. Um, let's create a little few more boards. It's telling me that I can build a sign, and a thermal measure, but we don't really want that. I just want the doodads. There we go. Now I can create my alchemy machine. Let's see if I can get it to place here. Might have to uh, pick up the sphere. Alright, now will you build? No. Nope. Oh, well, there it was for a second. That's close enough. It's fine. Alright, what else can I do now? Oh, you need food? Alright. Well, thank you for telling me. I appreciate it. That's where I have my grass, I think. Um, structures? No. Not gonna build a thermal measure. 
could build a parasol, and I will need a thermal stone coming up here. How my my pickaxe says 27%. We're mm -hmm. gonna go ahead and do this just to prototype it. Um, drop the thermal stone. Oh wait, I can't drop the thermal stone. There's moles everywhere. Right. Um, okay, so we need a little, few more cut stone. I got 26. Chester, where are you, Chester? like sleeping. Yeah, I don't have it enough and I actually don't have the uh let's drop a plant right there. Don't have my rot yet. How many days has it been? It's like like questioning like should take like well, doesn't it take two days? I don't know. It seems like it's been a while. Okay, so I need grasses, so I guess I'm going to go over here and hang out where the grasses grow. I guess it's not so far away that I should be too worried about it. And they're not in a nice clump for me, but they are over here. She's probably going to be hungry. pickaxe. And I do believe that I hear my first hound sound. That could be the bees. Alright, let's get this rock. And we want all these grasses. I have enough flowers to create a parasol, so that's what we're going to do. So that she can be dry. While I pick up grasses. Uh, the parasol has 50% rain resist, so it's a really good item for that purpose. Uh, parasol. Go get this flint. And I will need food. If I found some spiders, though, this is a pretty good place to hang out and get some rabbits right quick. So, things to do might be to go look for uh, some spiders. Also some veggies would not be a mess. Let's try that. Let's get a meatball in there. Since I have plenty of frogs. Um, and I did get some grass. Let's put our cut stone away on our boards. Yes, I know you're hungry. I've got some teeth. I can create some tooth traps. Let's get our meatballs. There we go. That solved your hunger, didn't it? Um, let's see what else we got here as far as resources. Um, am I out of twigs? It would appear that I am out of twigs. That is not good. I'm gonna plant these birch nuts. We're still got enough time. Another frog. Did I forget to cook you? No, I just didn't actually add you at all. Okay, so. Twigs? Nope. And Chester, do you have twigs on you? That frog is really interested in me. Uh, where can I go and get some twigs that I am not interested in? down here again, if I had it. 
Yeah, I don't have twigs here, but I can get... can get the rot. Let's plant those birches. Excellent. Let's see if these things have grown yet. No, they have not. Mm, Alright, well let's do some exploring then. Even though it's really late in the day. Okay, so some twigs out here. I kind of need to explore this peninsula and see if it's okay if I'm going to basically strip bare its resources or whether or not it's like a huge peninsula with um, like pig farms or piggies and whatnot. But I guess I should just explore it and then if I want to I can just dig it up. That would save me time. That carrot though. Well, that's not bad if I go into summer. So let's uh, pick all these twigs right here. Let's uh, shovel them up. And these grass clumps as well. some space, so Chester, how about you store my hammer for me? And unfortunately I'm running out of daytime. Alright, do I want to create a fire anywhere? Um, if I create it here, let's see here. If I create it here, I'll be able to, uh, probably dig up the most things. Alright. Let's create a small fire here. And we do want to dig up these grass clumps. So. And looks like we gotta add more fuel to our fire so we can see a little bit further. Mm, that didn't really add that much. Just disappointing. Where are you, Chester? Chester's like. Did they add an update where Chester like sleeps or something? All right, I need you to take my pickaxe and take the gold igniter as well, since I don't anticipate getting that. We have a tumbleweed over here. Oh, no way! All right. All right. Well, let's get these berry bushes. Get these twigs. Let's strip this place and add it to our retinue of resources. And I have to make the shovel. And the question is whether or not we should chop these birch nut trees since they're already already. That is a hard question that I do not know how to answer. I 
some 15 pine cones on me. I guess I'm probably not going to pick up another mushroom or carrot, so I'll put those on Chester. Here, take this. Take this. We're going to use those soon for food. Because she is a bit hungry. She doesn't say anything to me yet, but she is hungry. Alright. So that is pretty much bare. Um, I guess we'll chop the birch tree since we're here. Do I have 20 wood yet? Not yet. And then this question is like, okay, so are we close enough to... And I can't light this, right? She likes lighting fires, so maybe she has the ability to light these birch trees on fire, so where most players cannot light birch stumps on fire, I think. Get all those. Okay, I have 20 logs, so Chester, here, take a log. Can I light this on fire? I can light this on fire. Alright, well, let's do it so we get some ash. I could eat the berries if I wanted emergency. Well, I got jerky. So... Let's light you on fire. Hopefully you don't catch anything else on fire. I'm always paranoid that my ash is going to blow away. these trees. I think I'm going to be eating this jerky. It's already right, right there, ready for me to eat. Get my birch nuts. Good emergency food. You can add, combine with berries to make trail mix, which is a great healing food in the beginning of the game. Uh, this ash I'm collecting up now, I can use it to create healing souls later. And since I have all the moles I have, I don't. I'm not going to need. Uh, I'm not going to need the uh, the stone. I'll have I'll have surplus. fires. Should be all good. Alright. Let's uh, go dig up that twig right there at the edge. And get back to base. We've got 16 rot. I don't know how many... Um, I don't know how many... Uh, Berries plus uh, grass clumps I have, but you know. Oh, we got a meatball waiting for us. Good. Let's um, plant some twigs. Can I plant you there? Yep. Plant you there. Cannot plant you there. I don't know if I need all of these tweaks here. I mean, I guess one row of ten is going to be okay. Alright, let's do it. There is a way to do this one. It just basically makes it easier. I don't always do it that way because, you know, why make things easy on yourself as far as camera rotation and planting things, but you can do it that way. It is possible. Let's get these bushes. If anything's like these on fire, it's going to be real bad. 
and we'll use all of our fertilizer on these berries. Well, we'll go to 10 because I have a full 10 of grass. But she's hungry, so let's get her some food. We didn't mean to starve you, Willow. I'm sorry. is do I want to just let these nine flowers that I have do I just want to let them go to rot that would be the question what else I got in here I mean we're rot rot things. Not really. I do have the option to make some two traps. Five two traps. Would that do me much, though? I don't know. About 15 cones. That's pretty good. I could make another drying rack. You've got berries on me. What do you have, Chester? You have some vegetables. So, let's get that 20 off of that. Oh, I don't have another... Okay, well, I guess it's time to make another chest, then. One, two, three. There's a chest. And we probably need two more traps. guys are all very curious about what's going on. Let's make another trap. And do I want to dig up that grass stuff that's kind of in my way? Oh, I'm going to get a froggy. Nice. Excellent. That's kind of what I wanted, actually. Because I want to get this food off of Chester create some veggie sandwiches. Let's use the twigs, which I believe can work. We're going to test it out here. I'm going to dig up this grass stuff. Well, no, I guess I'll just leave it. Alright. I don't need... I have one spear. Okay, there's a parasol. Uh, let's get this jerky off. And get another small jerky going on. I have four seeds. Uh, let's do raw resources in this one. So, I wonder if these grasses are yet done. What else do I want to do? I created an alchemy machine. Now I'd kind of like to get some silk. Create that. We got another frog witch. Another small jerky. Want to use up those veggies while they're still good. Even though jerky has its uh, has its merits, definitely. And we got some twigs, which is nice. Twigs to create that that bun witch. It's gonna be real nice. And looks like we do need some more grass because I'm gonna have to create another trap here. But food is looking pretty good. Did that frog see me? No, the frog's okay. Alright, let's create another trap here. wall of traps. And I got most of this fertilized. I think we're going to let 
that stuff go to rot. And... Alright, so food. Bam. Taken care of. Birch nuts can be harvested. And I think that's probably where we're going to stop. We're going to get these two birch nuts, and the question is whether we start collecting the birch nuts now, or do we just let it go? Got a shovel. Get these two stumps. Got 20 birch nut logs. Let's plant two of them, or maybe three of them. Got some more twigs, that's nice. And some more frogs. So do I want small jerky or do I want or do I want food? Uh jerky will stay along a good time. Uh guess what we do since we have the twigs is we keep on doing Give me my carrots back since I'm gonna be using those a lot. Didn't want to use that. Darn it. Twig, twig. Alright, there we go. Alright, so when we come back, we will... What are we going to do? We're going to probably want some more rot. Um, could go out into the desert and try to get some more rocks. I have two deserts in this area. I don't know if that's... I guess that... Does that count as a rocky biome? There's a murr men village there which is a little bit unusual i kind of do need to explore and find some beefalo which would be really nice in this area and i have like a big plains right here and i also need to find uh spiders so that would be another thing that would be worthwhile trying to look into connect up these roads might be nice too i forget how you do that oh there's a spider right there um okay well that's what we're gonna go do we're gonna go make some more traps and get some spiders and start getting the silk needed to create a top hat and whatnot. So, thanks guys for watching. Hope you liked it, and we will see you soon. Bye bye.